In this video, we will look at evaluating a function at an expression. Just as we found with numerical values, when replacing a variable, we will always use parentheses. Keeping in mind that we can replace the variable not just with a number, but also with an expression. Let's take a look at some examples where functions are evaluated at an expression rather than at a number. In this problem, we're asked to find, find p of n minus 3. This means we are going to replace all the variables in the original function with n minus 3. So now, instead of seeing n squared, it gets replaced with n minus 3 squared minus 2n. But instead of just writing n, it's going to be replaced with n minus 3. Finally, plus 5. Notice we have replaced each of the variables with the expression n minus 3. Now, we just have to evaluate or simplify what we can in this expression. We can do our multiplication by squaring, squaring the first term, taking the product, negative 3n twice, negative 3n and negative 3n is negative 6n, and squaring the last to get plus 9. We can also distribute the negative 2 through, giving us negative 2n plus 6 and a plus 5 at the end. To finish this problem, we just have to combine like terms. We have an n squared, minus 6n minus 2n is minus 8n, plus 9, plus 6, plus 5 is plus 20. This is our simplified function, p of n minus 3. Let's take a look at another problem where we're asked to evaluate a function at an expression. In this problem, what we're asked to plug into the function f is 8x squared. This means we will replace both of the x's with 8x squared. When we do, we get the square root of 2x, which now gets replaced, in parentheses, with 8x squared, plus 3x, which now gets replaced with 8x squared. Multiplying what we end up with, we end up with the square root of 16x squared, plus 24x squared. You may notice we can take the square root of 16, which is 4, and the square root of x squared, which is just x, and with nothing left in the radical, we have 4x plus 24x squared. When we replace our variable with 8x squared, we end up with the function 4x plus 24x squared. Just as we could replace the variables with a number, we can also replace them with a function, always remembering parentheses.